everyone, I'm going to share with you how to make another ornament for Christmas. And um, I have this little paper here that is 8.5 inch by 11 inch. This is how you make the circle. This is how I make this uh, circle, everyone. Fold it in half and it fold in again. If you want to make a bigger circle, just follow this and go with your measurement, okay? And now I make the ornament of 7 inch circle. So I'm if 7 inch, I'm going to do 3 and half. Because the way we fold, so we only make it three and a half. Turn it around like this, okay? So turn around three and a half. And if you want to make eight, then you go to do four. If you want to make nine, then you do four and a half. Just so on. Do half, half, okay? After you fold, you do half of the, the size of the circle you want to have. I'm using the red and green, what I have cut here, too. Okay, so that's seven inch circle right here that I have. Seven inch, okay, and then I have the red and the green. After I cut this out, I'm using this template, and I go down to a quarter of an inch. to use heat and bone tape I have cut it out here you can go to Walmart and you can find this the whole row they hang it up where you have the interface and then thing like that they already pre-cut this one one time that I went to Hoppy Loppy they already cut it out and they on sale for a dollar for like 20 yeah something like that oh my goodness I always come into the, the right place in the right time put the, the green one here and then I'm going to put this red one together if you do the 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 print then you have to face the rice the right side to the right side okay right side of the green and right side of the red together So now, after you um, iron the interface in, it's all around here, you go into so If you are new to my channel, I always uh, um, ask the people to sew on the side of the interface. Do not sew it on the paper, on the interface. In, because when you're inside out, it's going to make it so weird looking. So go on the side of it. Follow this interface in and sew all around. You're going to leave about two inches open so you can inside out. I sew around and this is the space that I left it open I'm going to do this everyone like that just cut a little bit right there okay and then from here I'm gonna fold it before I take the paper out so when it's still half the paper it's really easy to do this so I suggest that people do that only you don't need to do the whole, the, the whole entire thing, but you only do when it's uh, the round area right here. But 
right up. And now I'm going to take off the paper. Because you have to leave the paper in there before you fold it, so it's thicker, it's easy for you. Alright, I'm going to inside out. You don't need to do anything on this side. No zigzag or anything if you if you sew around the interface and like that. Go slow because when you have your iron down the interface and inside the hidden bone tape, it's going to glue those two together, the green and the red. So go very easy. Take it easy when you iron. The opening space right there, I'm going to add the heat and bone tape. Close it, iron this. You're going to do little at the time. Take this. Take this off. Put it back on. So now I'm going to fold it in half. You're going to fold it again. Make sure this line is meet the line here. That way you have the even. This just come into my brain. So I have to show you. It's very cute. So now when I'm done, I'm going to fold it this way. After you fold like this, you see the center that we have it right here? We go on to bring this to the center. You're going to go from here half an inch, you're going to fold it out. You can measure or you can eyeball it. And then on this side, you're going to go by this and then you're going to fold it out. Right up. You can take this out and then you iron this.
after that, after you take out a clip, you can turn into this side. Okay, and then you're going to iron in the back. One after you iron and everything like this, I have my glue gun, my yucky glue gun on, and I'm gonna leave it on the side for now. And I'm going to make a bow. I have cut the ribbon is eight inches long, and I fold it in half. You can make this for the hair bow for kit, everyone. You can mark right in the middle. Okay, and then this one right here, you're going to hold one side and then fold like this away from you. Go like this. And then this one, it folded in, just like you're making number eight. But make sure it go like that. Go like that. Bring this over to the center, like right in the middle, like that. And this one right here, you're going to bring it over. Just like so. And I'm going to go from here. Fold it and sew all the way. Right in the center, okay? Make sure right in the center. And then pull. When you pull, you're going to wrap this around. And this is how you make that bow. You see how cute that is? Wrap another one. And then I'm going to back here. I'm going to make the loop and then come out. Don't need to do much. One, go to Walmart. It's only 47 cents. Don't go to a dollar store. Could they sell a dollar twenty-five? You fold this ribbon in half, and then that two end right here. You're gonna tie this, the end. Like that, okay? I got the bits here at the, at the Dollar Tree. So now I'm going to go back in here. Right on the fold, okay? A little bit like that. Okay, go on the side. Remember when you put the um, put the glue put at the fold. Don't put it right at the beginning, okay? Because you're gonna put the picture, the frame in here. See that? It's so cute. And then on this one right here, you're gonna. Pull this down all the way and then just add a little bit of the of the glue there so this string don't lose the, the bead. Alright, and then now you're gonna go find this spot at the pointy right here, then you ask the bow. Ta da! Just leave it there for a while. Look at that, everyone. That is so adorable. Put the picture frame in here.
Got your kid or whoever you want to give this to. I'm going to pick up my kid, but when I come back, I'm going to stuck the picture in here so you can see. Look how cute this is, everyone. This is beautiful, and it's so simple to do. And if you want to put the gift card in there, you can, but if not, you can put your kid picture. I'm not going to use my kid picture, but I use this. So the picture have to be a two and two in and quarter by two and a two inch and a quarter all around okay and then you're gonna get stuck right inside of here that's why i told you when you add the glue as at the fold so you have room out here to slide the picture over like inside like so you use your kid picture not snowman okay or you know the person that I, you give it out to put the gift card behind here and how cute that is you can hang up on the tree, put the gift card behind or money behind, and then their name in the front if you want to, or their picture. Make sure you click on the like button, everyone. The other day, when the people, a lot of people, click on the like button, and it really helped my video a lot. So the like button is very important to our video, everyone, and our channel in general. So thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you're new to our channel, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share the video with other people. And um, make sure the bell notification turn on too, so when I upload a video, you don't miss any. Love you.